All right, YouTube, we just pulled up to the OG spot, man. This is where we started all the public cuts about a year and a half ago, almost two years now. But we just pulled up. It's the start of summer. It's the top of May. So everybody's coming outside. Today, we're going to go out. We're going to try to do at least two haircuts today and see if we get some good energy out. But yeah, you know, now we're feeling sideways. So we get to take y'all with us. We're going to give y'all the full behind the scenes. We're going to run y'all through the whole public cut. We're going to show y'all the things we ain't never show y'all before. So follow along with us and let's see who we could come across today. Hey, I'm gonna be honest, y'all. I always get them little jitters before I do this, man. I'm still nervous to walk up to people. I gotta get it out of me. I'm still nervous, man. What's up, dog? You got time for a cut? I just got one. Are you fresh already? He clean, damn, he clean. It is a summer day. So we try to stay away from anybody that's profusely sweating. Can't see too much glistening on the skin, man. It's gonna be hard to knock that haircut out. Yo, yo. Yo, what's up, dog? Hey, man, my name's Vic. It's a pleasure to meet you. Sir? Uh, uh, I said my name is Vic. It's a pleasure to meet you, man. Yeah, you, you wouldn't happen to have time for a free haircut, would you? Uh, you know what? I'm going back to my apartment. Uh, back to your spot? You might as well go back to your spot fresh. I, w I really would, but I actually have to, like, my buddy's going to be there in, like, five minutes. Ah. Uh, um, I'll, see, I'll see if I can come back. All right, let me know. Hey, if you come back, we'll, I, I, if I'm here, I, we'll see, all right? As long as I ain't got nobody in my chair, I got you. How you doing, sir? I'm good, man. Would you happen to have time for a free haircut today? Nah. Understood. Yo, yo, my guy, what's going on? What's up, man? Nah. Tough crowd, man. Tough crowd today, man. Yo. Yo. Yo, yo. What's good, man? What's up, bro? You want to have time for a free cut, would you? You got time? Yeah, for sure. Good to meet you, man. Yeah, man. Where you been? Here. Yeah? Yeah. What's your name? Vic. Are you ready for this cut? Come on, man. Let's do it. This is crazy, bro. So this is fire. This is fire, man. Yeah, this is man. fire, man. <laughs> Yo, the last, hey man, the last dude ignored me hard, so. Yeah, I'm gonna talk to you. Yeah, the last dude, hey, the last dude, I reached my hand out, bro. You know, he didn't want to put his hand out oh, to where? shake me up. Y'all oh. like, damn. What kind of haircut do you want? Um, I'm putting it in your hands, man. Put it in my hands? Yeah, yeah I'm putting it in your hands. All right, hey, look, you in good hands, my guy. What is your name and what do you do? My name is Christian. I'm an entrepreneur. What made you pursue entrepreneurship? Uh, Man, wanting to work for myself, man. I didn't like work a lot of jobs, did everything. And just having this mindset of getting my own, you know. Where you from? From Raleigh, North Carolina. You know where I'm from? Fayetteville, North Carolina. Stop laughing. Bro, I knew it was something about you. Ah, you failed me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you failed me. Right out of the field, man. Nah. Nah, 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 yeah. nah, nah. Look, I know where you at. How did growing up in Raleigh help define who you are as a person? Oh man, staying disciplined, grounded, hungry. I'm always hungry, man. Where do you think you get your hunger from? <sighs> My parents instilled, instilled in me uh, providing for your family. Uh, it don't never stop, man. I ain't never seen my mom, dad stop working. What's up, dog? I appreciate you. You got a kickflip? You got a kickflip? Oh, shit. What's up? You got a kickflip? Nah, I can't do kickflip. But you got to shove it. What you got? Nothing? I do bowls, man. Let me get a kickflip, dog. Let me get a kickflip. Come on, bro. No, no, you got to stop that. Stop that. Hey. Ah! That's what we talking about, man. With the BB Simmons belt on, yeah. Good to meet y'all, man. Got a photo? Yeah, come, let's do it. Yeah, let's knock it out. Hey, Let me show y'all this Nolly Trail I hit the other day. My first one. Oh! oh y'all yeah. be safe, man. All right, y'all be safe, bro. That's love, man. Oh, I love the energy, man. Yeah, you get that off? Sometimes, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. But I, it's every time it's special, man. Like when people, people show love. I, I appreciate it. What's been your proudest accomplishment this year? Um, my dad was battling cancer. I'm sorry about that, fam. No, no problem, man. Appreciate it. But it got real bad, like, real quick. Yeah. And then, and they had to rush my dad to the emergency room. 
And my mom called me. I was down here, and like she was uh -huh. just like, "Yo, you ain't gotta come. Like he's okay. What he woo?" And I just felt something, man. I was like, "Man, she lying. She lying." Like I know she be trying to protect me, you know, not try to get me to worry too much. Absolutely. But I was like, man, I felt something, man. I got a flight home, and seeing my mom just like happy to see me crying, like didn't think I was gonna come. That meant the world to me, man. Man, I'm proud of you, bro. That meant the world to me. I'm proud of you, man. <laughs> that meant the man, world. Man, because look, my uncle had a heart attack a couple months ago. I had to do the same thing for the fam, bro. Yeah. Hardest thing I ever had to do. So I know what you feel like, man. You had to pull through and be the glue for the family real quick, bro. That's, that's a lot. How's Dude, Pops man. doing right now? <laughs> bro, this dude healthier than, bro, healthier than ever. Yeah! God, bro. Yeah. God, bro. God, yeah. Like, I've seen my dad, like, man, at his worst, man. And for, for for me to be able to see him change his whole life around, I just know anything's possible, you know what I mean? I always known that, but... Well, Pops, Pops man, showed you. He just showed me, man. Just showed me. Yeah, hey, you gonna be great, man. Sound like your Pops a, a A1 man. Yeah, yeah, man. I love that, man. He be on the grill? Yeah, man. You know. You, you know how to grill? Not really, man. Come on, bro. Uh, man, look, man. I cut you from Raleigh, you know? Yeah. I'm from Fayetteville. We grill down there. I don't know what y'all be doing up there. Y'all got the city and shit, man. <laughs> man, I don't know. Y'all don't know, man. I ain't look. never jump on it like that. Like. Man, bro, you gotta be out there. Yeah. You gotta be out there spend that time on I that do. grill. I gotta try something. Gotta what's your what's your special uh, specialty on the grill? Chicken, man. I'm nasty with it. Yeah. All right, one of the best, one of the greatest. Like, what I do to the grill should be illegal. <laughs> Feel me? Like, when I get on the grill, someone should call the cops oh, and be like, hey, man, oh, big yeah. on the grill, bro. Y'all sure? <laughs> like, man, I'm okay. wicked on the grill. Okay. All right? Don't ask me to do everything else. Look, chicken. Just leave it at that. I can bust a couple sides. But I know, what, I know what I'm great at. I know what I'm great at. How do you feel right now, bro? Uh, I feel blessed. I can't. I, man, ain't no words can describe how I feel. I'm just... I'm just listening to God, man. Absolutely, bro. Just listen. My dad is a barber, so. Oh, your dad's a barber? Yeah, so. Oh, you ain't even tell me that. Yeah, so, like, I ain't never been in no barber shop until I came down here. You always been getting shot by pops? Always, man. That's special, bro. That's very special. I know y'all done had some legendary cuts. <laughs> Yeah, bro, he cut my hair drunk one time. Yeah. Yeah, that shit was fire. <laughs> fire, yeah, you lace, right? Yeah. Bro, I was nervous in the mug, though. I was like, Nah, man. bro, that one pops getting his bag, bro. Yeah. Pops getting his bag in that Bro, that's top. what he said, bro. He was like, bro, I cut some of the best hair with him. <laughs> he getting that bag, man. He started really finessing. I was like, bro, get out of here, bro. What's up, family? Shit, I'm from Fayetteville, bro. Are you from the Ville? Yeah, we're oh, That's here. love. You from Raleigh. Oh, shit, what's good, boy? Yeah, man. Right. I just yeah, ran in there, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, How hard was it for you to move out of Raleigh? It wasn't hard at all. I told my mom, I'm out, man. For real. Like, was you worried at all? Yeah, she was worried. You know, me and being, I had no family out here. But me, man, I'm, I was just ready. Ready to make something of myself, man. It's amazing. Hey, when you started cutting, was you taking every opportunity? Every opportunity. Every opportunity. I asked God to eat. Am I about to sit back here and be picky with my food and I was praying to eat the whole time? But I'm trying to get all mine. Right. I'm taking a crumb if you got a crumb for me. In the beginning, it's like that. But as you grow and you define your brand and your business, every opportunity isn't an opportunity that we take. It don't gotta be a whole loaf every time. I'm cool with a crumb right now. Shoot. Bro, you got me tight, man. I see it. Come on, man. Right Come now. on, oh, man. Hey, he peeking, man. He peeking. Oh, my God. Come on, he trying to peek, man. You ready, bro? Yeah, I'm ready for it. All right, man. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Damn. All right, now, you know, whatever you want, you know? When you got to cut like this, when you got to cut like this, man, whatever you want, you know? It's your world now. Yeah, man. <laughs> your conversations today remind me of what it meant to be planted and just to be rooted in your purpose, bro, for real. So I want to pass you one of these. 
Like I said, man, it's my brand that I'm building called the Planet Collective, and it just stands for being rooted in your purpose and knowing what you got to do out here. So, fam, like, thank you for everything. Thank you, man. Thank you, man, for real.